1 Samuel chapter 27 And David says to his heart, Now I am consumed by the hand of Saul one day. There is nothing better for me than I diligently escape to the land of the Philistines, and Saul has been despairing of me, of seeking me any more in all the border of Israel, and I have escaped out of his hand. And David rises and passes over, he and six hundred men who are with him, to Achish, son of Maok, king of Gath. And David dwells with Achish in Gath, he and his men, each one with his household, even David and his two wives, Ahinom the Jezreelitess, and Abigail, wife of Nabal, the Carmelitess. And it is declared to Saul that David has fled to Gath, and he has not added to seek him any more. And David says to Achish, Now if I have found grace in your eyes, they give a place to me in one of the cities of the field, and I dwell there. Indeed, why does your servant dwell in the royal city with you? And Achish gives Ziklag to him that day. Therefore Ziklag has been for the kings of Judah unto this day. And the number of the days which David has dwelt in the field of the Philistines is one year of days and four months. And David and his men go up, and they push toward the Geshurite, and toward the Gerizite, and the Amalekite, for they are inhabitants of the land from of old, as you come to shore, and to the land of Egypt. And David has struck the land, and does not keep alive man and woman, and has taken sheep, and oxen, and donkeys, and camels, and garments, and turns back, and comes to Achish. And Achish says, To where have you pushed today? And David says, Against the south of Judah, and against the south of Jeramelite, and to the south of the Kenite. David keeps alive neither man nor woman to bring in word to Gath, saying, Lest they declare it against us, saying, Thus David has done, and thus is his custom all the days he has dwelt in the fields of the Philistines. And Achish believes in David, saying, He has made himself utterly abhorred among his people in Israel, and has been for a perpetual servant to me.